First of all, I want to uh, bring in Rodrigo Rodriguez, and he is an MD, uh, medical director for the BioCare Hospital and Medical Center in San Ysidro, California. So come on in, doctor. Thanks for being here. We, we appreciate it. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you for inviting us. And uh, as I was mentioning, we're doing a live web stream. To our, we've launched our new website called Native Media Network, and uh, I've been telling people, you know, there's such a, we're, we're, that we're set up right outside the trade show, and there is a diversity of people here. So maybe first of all, you could just uh, introduce yourself to our viewers. Yes, uh, I'm Dr. Rodrigo Rodriguez, as you already said, medical director of Biocare Hospital. And we're actually across the border from San Diego, California. We're like 30 minutes from San Diego Airport. And uh, there is where we have this alternative medical center. Okay. We work a lot with uh, degenerative disease, and, but most important is prevention. Mm -hmm. We have to learn to do what our ancestors did very well, that we're missing out in that part in, in, a, in a great deal, mm -hmm. because of course there's a lot of information from the pharmaceutical industry and from the food industry, mm -hmm. but that, that's not exactly what we were meant to be or what we were uh, right. meant to have. Mm -hmm. So we're seeing the consequences, we're seeing early diseases like diabetes, high blood pressure, uh, heart disease, and all of them are preventable, all of them yes. are reversible, and we work a lot with people in uh, bringing them to do detoxification and, and doing treatments that are going to hopefully bring them back into the health track and, and have a longer living and, and enjoyment, and that's what, what we do. And we love to hear from people who have medical questions and, and help them out to guide them to make changes. We can start making changes tonight, mm -hmm. immediately, in how we eat, how we live, because and, and also teaching our younger yeah. generation. Because when we're talking about the future generation, well, we want them to be healthy. And the best way to do that is go back to our ancestor, because our ancestor knew very well how to be healthy and how to eat. And the more we enter into I'm, I'm, the, I'm feeling guilty because I just ate a handful of M and M's. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> and now I'm like, oh no. And let me uh, take let me take the, that that <laughs> thing to tell people that sugar is a poison. Sugar is very bad. Okay, yeah. so that's something. That's one of the things that we, we should learn. And I always offer people the opportunity to to ask questions. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a, a, a an email address. Uh, and people can feel free to drop a question, a medical question. You don't have to give us your, even your name, let alone any charges or anything like that. It's completely free. But we like to people to discuss openly about uh, health issues and questions and, and, and learn about it because we have to learn to do things a lot better than what the industry is telling us to do because that's literally killing us. We're seeing a lot of other way to say the least and, and many diseases that come through. Yeah, and so, um, you know, while you're saying this, I've done a lot of uh, health programs and interviewed people in the health field and in, in Native America. And so these are, these are universal issues. Absolutely. Uh -huh. There are universal issues. But one of the problems that we have when we do not belong to the, to the general Western group, I'm Mexican, mm -hmm. okay, uh, is that our genes, because of our ancestry, right. are right. prepared to save energy, to, to conserve it. So if we eat the same as other people eat, we're, we tend to gain weight very fast. It affects us worse. Much worse. You see, we were meant to eat in a different way. Uh, more wholesome, more vegetables, and more things. Yeah. And, and in your culture, as in ours, meats were for festivities. Yes. It's not something we had every. for every day. You see. And now we eat a lot of meat, a lot of sugars. We, we were not meant to eat refined carbohydrates. Right. We had wild rice, wild grains, and wild everything, and that's the way we, we develop our, our culture and our, our bodies. And uh, how do you get that message 
down to the community level, down to the grassroots level, down to the people who are uh, selecting the food, who are preparing the food, you know, what, what kind of outreach can be done to, because it seems like there's been a lot of outreach uh, throughout Native America, uh, but, but still we're, we're, we're seeing a slight change. And, and we won't really know until we start to see this next generation come up. But, but, but how do you get that message to the people who, who don't have the money, uh, who don't necessarily uh, have access to uh, healthy foods? You know what? I, I think that eating right in many ways is cheap. One, yeah. because uh, the less meat you eat, the less money you're going to spend. Okay, that's, yeah. Grains and veggies and fruits are normally cheaper than, than other forms. Mm -hmm. that's, that's for one. Now, how we get to people, we go to conventions, we talk to people, and uh, we have a website, and we are on Facebook, and we give recipes to people. And again, I have an, e uh, uh, an uh, email address that people can write me to, and it, uh, you don't have to give me any, any names or anything like that, there's no strings attached. But if you say, doctor, I have, a, I have been diagnosed with early diabetes or I'm having this problem and my weight is 200 pounds, etc., I'm going to tell you good advice of what you can do and what you can help uh, yourself with. Mm -hmm. and, and once again, you have to talk to your children about this because if we want a healthier generation to come, it's really in our hands, our, uh, the parents, the teachers, the people that have the, the formal education and the responsibility of educating the, the generations to come. Okay. And the website is biocarehospital.com mm -hmm. and your email is doctor. That's dr. Dot. No, the, okay, the, you, you the, give the, 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 the easiest one? one is doctor. Oh. At Biocare Hospital. Spelled out. Spelled out. D O C T O R. Doctor at biocarehospital.com. Okay. Rodrigo, thank you so much. Uh, thank you. My pleasure. Did you, did you want to say something else? No. Okay. I, I just want people to follow through. Uh, your children's health is in your hands. That's all I can do. Okay. Thank you very much, Doctor. Thank Rodrigo. you very much. Appreciate thank you. that. Okay.